Toy Station. Zoe's Preschool Corner. Hi, boys and girls, and welcome to another episode of Zoe's Preschool Corner. How are you today? Oh, that's great. I'm glad you're doing good. I'm good too. Guess what? Today, we're going to be looking at fruits and vegetables. Do you like fruits and vegetables? That's good. I like them too. I mostly like fruits. <laughs> fruits are my favorite because they're sweet. Like me. <laughs> but vegetables are very good too. So, let's go see some fruits and vegetables. Maybe we'll learn a little bit and we'll learn some colors. Let's go, boys and girls. Vegetable time. Miss Chloe? Yes, Zoe? Do you think you can help us with our fruits and vegetables today? Of course, Zoe. I'd be happy to. Yay! All right, boys and girls. Let's start with our vegetables. Here we have a green pepper. Green peppers are very yummy and very high in vitamin C. You sometimes see green peppers on pizza. Green peppers also come in red, orange, and yellow. Here we see a red pepper and it's also very high in vitamin C. I didn't know peppers came in so many colors. Wow! <laughs> Boys and girls, do you know what this purple vegetable is? That's right, it's eggplant. And it's almost always used in eggplant parmesan. It's very low in fat and very good for you. Oh, oh, Miss Chloe, can I guess this one? I know what it is. I know I do. Okay, Zoe. What is it? It's celery. Very good, Zoe. It is celery. Celery is a green vegetable. It's very good for you as well. And it's very high in vitamin K. Here we see our yummy brown mushroom. Sometimes mushrooms are brown. Sometimes they're white. They come in different colors, but they're usually... Mushrooms are often seen on pizza and are very high in vitamin B, so they're very good for you. Boys and girls, never, never, never eat mushrooms if you see them in your garden. Those are not the kind of mushrooms you eat. You only eat mushrooms that your mom and dad give you, okay? That's very good advice, Zoe. All right, what do we have here? And that's right, boys and girls, it's an onion. Onions also come in many different colors. They come in red, they come in brown, sometimes yellow, and even white. Onions are a very good source of vitamin B and C. Onion? Does anybody like onion? Ooh. vegetable. Do you, Zoe? That's great. Do you know what this vegetable is, boys and girls? That's right. It's potato. Potato is yummy, and I don't know many people who don't like it. Potatoes are used in tater tots, in mashed potatoes, baked potatoes, and even french fries. Mmm, <laughs> yummy. And look what we have here. A green cucumber. It looks like a pickle to you. There's a reason. Pickles are made from cucumbers. Pickles are usually put in vinegar with different spices, left there to ferment for quite a while, and then turn into a yummy pickle. I love pickles on my cheeseburger. That makes it just perfect. <laughs> Me too, Zoe. Next up, we have bok choy. Bok choy? What is bok choy? 
bok choy is a Chinese type of cabbage. It's very delicious and used very often in Asian food. It's beautiful, yummy, and green. And it's very good for you. Do you know what this one is, boys and girls? Of course you do. It's lettuce. Lettuce is used in sandwiches and making yummy salads. You put it in your burgers. Oh, so delicious. I agree, Miss Chloe. Lettuce is really good. I couldn't imagine having a burger without it. <laughs> I know, right, Zoe? It's not only delicious, but it's very good for you. It's super high in vitamin K. Ooh, here we have a beautiful orange carrot. Carrots are so yummy and sweet. They're often used in soups and in salads. And they make everything look so beautiful and taste delicious. Did you know that eating carrots is actually very good for your eyes? I didn't know that, Miss Chloe. That's very good information. I'm sure this vegetable needs no introduction. Everybody knows what this is, right? Of course! They're sweet peas. Now peas come in a pod, and once you open the pod, there's little peas inside. And those are the peas that we eat. They're sweet and green. I'm sure many of you eat peas. Now here's our super delicious broccoli. What? You don't like broccoli? Oh, I love broccoli and it's actually very good for you. I like broccoli too, mostly when it has cheese sauce. Some say tomato, some say tomato. It doesn't matter how you say it, tomato, tomato. Tomato is an excellent vegetable, full of vitamin, what? It's not a vegetable, it's a fruit. You say it's a fruit? <laughs> I've heard that too, have you heard that, Zoe? I have heard that, Miss Chloe, the tomato's not a vegetable, that it is a fruit. <laughs> okay, well, I'll have to look into that, but I'm pretty sure, you're right, I'm pretty sure it's a fruit. Either way, tomato is such a delicious food. You can put it on pizza, you can put it on pasta, you can put it on a sandwich. Oh my goodness, the possibilities are endless. So eat tomato, it's very good for you and very high in vitamin C. Fruit time. Oh my goodness, this is so much fun. I love it! I'm so glad you're having fun, Zoe. Now it's time to introduce our fruit. Let's start with bananas. Bananas are super yummy. They're used in pudding, they're used on top of cereal, they're used in desserts, they're used in cakes and breads. Oh my goodness, so many different things. Bananas are really, really good. And they're packed with vitamin B, so they're really healthy for you too. I like bananas too. Do you like bananas? When you add bananas and strawberries, you can make a really good smoothie. Yum. These smoothies are delicious, Zoe. Now let's move on to our next fruit, the green pear. Ooh, green pears are yummy and sweet and taste oh so delicious. They kind of look like an apple, but they're not, and it's a totally different flavor. So try a pear, it's really good. All right, boys and girls, I'm sure you know what these are. Of course, they're grapes. And grapes come in many different colors. They come in crimson, in black, dark blue, yellow, green, even orange and pink. Can you believe it? So many different varieties of grapes. Did you know that each little cluster of grapes can have anywhere from 15 to 300 grapes? Wow, that's a lot. And here we have our green grapes. Which color grapes do you like best? Ooh, yummy grapes. I like the green ones best. When life gives you lemons, make lemonade. Or lemon pie, or lemon tart, or lemon cake. Lemons are very tart and they're kind of sour. But if you add a little sugar, they're just perfect. 
Lemons are super healthy for you as well, and they're very high in vitamin C. Now what do we got here, boys and girls? <laughs> That's right, an apple. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. That's what they say. Is it true? I don't know. But I do know that apples are very good for you. Apples very good, and sometimes it's even better in a pie. <laughs> now here we have the cherry. Do you like cherries? I love cherries. What about you, Zoe? Oh, Miss Claire really, really like cherries. I just hate the seed in the middle. <laughs> okay, I can understand that. Now cherries are very good for you and they're high in vitamin C. They come in different colors, starting all the way from like yellow to a dark red. So cherries can be very different in color. Not only are they different in color, but sometimes in taste. Did you know that cherries are not only sweet, but some are actually sour? Oh, this is one of my favorites! <laughs> I'm sure it is, Zoe. This is a fruit that needs absolutely no introduction. Who doesn't love strawberries? Everybody loves strawberries, right? They're bright red and beautiful and sweet as can be. You can put them in cakes, and you can put them in jam, and you can put them in tarts. Oh my goodness, you can just eat strawberries with cream. It's so delicious. It's hard to believe that something so yummy could be so good for you. But guess what? It really is. Oh, strawberries are so yummy. Do you like strawberries? I knew it. All right, boys and girls, we're down to our very last fruit. And it's a good one. Do you know what it is? <laughs> That's right, it's a peach. Peach is another super yummy fruit that's also very good for you. It's peach in color, it's furry on the outside, and it can be put in all sorts of things or eaten just as it is. It's just as good. And there you have it, boys and girls, your whole basket of fruit and vegetables. I hope you enjoyed learning about vegetables and fruit and how good they can be for you and how tasty they are. This was so super fun to do. Didn't you think so, Zoe? Oh yes, Miss Chloe, this was so much fun. And I loved learning about all the fruits and vegetables. I'm glad, Zoe. And I hope you had fun too, boys and girls. Be sure to visit us again real soon. Take care and see you next time. Boys and girls, do you know why fruits and vegetables are so good for you? That's right, because they're healthy and good for your body. It helps you to have good nutrition and it helps you to stay healthy. So be sure to eat all your fruits and vegetables. They're very good for you. Thanks for watching, boys and girls. And be sure to tune in here with me at Zoe's Preschool Corner on Toy Station. Bye-bye. Love you.